Hello and welcome to Car Deco, where we help you pick better. Now there are a whole lot of things that we like about Tata's all new compact sedan, the Tigor. And then there are some that we wish could have been better. Here's a quick look at where the Tigor scores and where it doesn't. Now it may look a lot like the Tiago from the front, but it's definitely more handsome. You also get those double barrel projector headlamps which get those smoked treatment which you see in slightly more expensive cars but the part that you'd admire the most about the Tigor it's rear the coupe like design and the swooping rear even remind us of the BMW X6 if you're buying the petrol you also get those 15 inch alloys which look really stylish looking for a compact sedan that's high on style well the Tigor fits that bill now, space is usually not a strong point of the compact sedans, but the Tigor does really well here. And that's thanks to the longer wheelbase, which is 50 mm more than the Tiago. The seat cushioning is plush and you can seat three average size adults fairly comfortably. And what's more, the Tigor also gets a rear armrest with cup holders. Now one of the highlights of the Tigor is its boot space which is a massive 419 liters which is not only more than the Tata Zest but also all the other compact sedans. The special mechanism for the boot doesn't eat into the boot space and it allows you for a wide boot opening which in turn lets you pack in more luggage. If there's one thing us Indians love a lot then it's got to be features. And Tata has ensured that the Tigor comes loaded. The top of the line XZ variant comes with a new 5 inch touchscreen infotainment system from Harman, which also works as a display for the reversing camera. There's also an automatic climate control, a cool glove box, and a 12 volt socket for rare passengers. One of the things that you would appreciate about the Tigor is how well the suspension handles our Indian road conditions. The ride quality is very, very good, especially the diesel which comes with those 14 inch rims. It just soaks in the bumps and the potholes without a fuss. While we can't stop raving about the Tigor's boot space, it does come with its own set of challenges. For instance, um, there is no boot release switch on the boot itself. To open the boot, you need to press a button on the dashboard which is electrically operated which means you need to keep the ignition on at all times. Alternatively, you can use the key fob to manually open the boot or there is a button as well on the key fob but for some strange reason it hasn't been labeled properly. Looking for a quiet ride, Tigor may just disappoint you there because uh, there is a lot of road, engine and some wind noise also seeping into the cabin. The AC, while it's great at cooling, also is ends up being a bit loud, which was also a problem with the Tiago. The Tigor carries forward the powertrain from the Tiago. It's also about 40 to 50 kgs heavier than the hatchback. And therein lies the problem. While the gearing has been changed to aid fuel efficiency, if you're looking for a car that's aimed at performance or is peppy, then you might want to consider some other sedan. Still, if you would want to go for the Tigor, we would suggest you go for the petrol Tigor as the diesel one feels a little too dull to drive. And finally, while the Tigor does come loaded with features, we really wish uh, it came with a few more, for instance the LED DRLs. Also the Harman system, while it sounds awesome, we wish Tata had integrated Android Auto and Apple CarPlay with it. And lastly, despite the focus uh, on the backseat experience, uh, we wish uh, the Tigor came with rare AC vents, which would have really made the package even more compelling. Overall, the pros of the Tigor outweigh the cons. It's a great package and it looks set to shake up the compact sedan segment. So that was the Tata Tigor for you. If you want to know more about the Tigor, do hit up the link above for our quick review on the compact sedan. And if you enjoyed watching this video, do like, share and subscribe to Car Deco 
for more such content.